guys, it's E-Rock once again. Welcome to my Final Fantasy XIV Let's Play. Uh, last we left off, we were giving Laurentis of the Woodwellers them rocks. Uh, <laughs> he's a traitor. He's a traitor of the Gridania, the Woodwellers. So now, um, Bluskran tells us that he has found the Elder Sylph. So let's see what he has to say to us. It's taken us a fair old while, but we finally got our hands on some reliable information concerning the whereabouts of your missing green friend. <laughs> His name is Frixio, and he is the eldest among the sylphs of Little Solace. Long has uh, he represented his kind in dialogue with Gridanians. Yes, he's like a bridge between us and them, a small leafy green bridge that we can't find at the moment. And bridges are no use if you don't know where they are. That's why it's so important that we find them. There's an abandoned dungeon called the Thousand Maws of Toto Rock here in the South Shroud. It was by the entrance to the place that Frixio was seen, and not long ago, neither. If you hurry, I reckon you'll find him. Walking ones, please help this one. This one needs help. Needs help to help Elder One. Poor Frixio, poor, poor Frixio. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold your chocobos. Take a deep breath and tell us what's wrong, nice and slow. Elder One went into Toto Rock, but has not returned. This one is worried, so very worried. And you're right to be. The place fair crawls with nasties, waiting to make a meal of anyone daft enough to wander in. What in the seven hells was he thinking, entering that bloody death trap? Elder One had no choice. Imperial Ones was chasing Elder One. Please, Walking Ones must help Elder One. Help Elder One now. Ah. The fates conspire against, against us. Forgive my pragmatism, but Frixio is our best hope of reaching an accord with the Sylphs. We, if, were we to lose him, all our efforts thus far will have been for naught. I will tend to her wounds. Ida, make haste to the Outer Nest and request assistance. Understood. Saya, go to a thousand miles of Toto Rock and see that Frixio comes to no harm. Peace between man and self rest upon your success. Got it. How come I can't go to Granani and get assistance? Why why I gotta go to the dangerous place? I tell you, the bear they just stand around and do nothing and they send me into the lion's den. I just don't appreciate it. I just don't. Bloiserant. By order of the Elder Seed Seer, the dungeon known as the Thousand Miles of Total Rock has been placed under the control of... What? The Self Elder is inside? And you are sure of this? How in the seven hells did he manage to sneak by? God strike me down for a purblind fool. You must find the Self Elder before he falls prey to the fiends within. Interest to the Total Rock is ordinarily restricted, but these are exceptional circumstances. Pray, assemble a rescue party, and enter as soon as you are ready. <clears throat> Rescue party. I have just the people in mind. <laughs> Me and my crew. about it.
I could help DPS, but again, I only have cure, so <clears throat> she gets too low on health. I don't have cure two to get them back up quickly. So I gotta be more gotta be careful. how uh, the Elder Sylph made it past all these dangerous monsters, big bugs. Uh, the first boss. He put poison on him. I gotta as soon as the poison off.
darkness. If I deign to speak in my guest crew tongue, we meet at last. I am Lahabrea of the Asians, servant to the one true God. Yours is a most fantastical tale, truly absorbing. It is a tale to tell Eorzea's children before bedtime, and it will soon be dark, bringer of light. The dark minions. All that stands between this world and darkness is an irksome anomaly in the ether. The Echo. Yes, yours is a most fascinating tale. Alas, like all good tales, it must needs come to an end, but fear not. Ooh, that's not good. Here, feel the presence of evil. For the end of your tale is but the beginning of another. The tale of the crystal's demise. Ooh. That's not good at all. Let's go, team. Me and my crew. I 
at the elder sylph. Finally, fresh air. Mayhap not so fresh, but better than before. Ah, uh, sinister one is gone. This one can leave this awful place. Hmm? The walking one vanquished the many legged one. This one is grateful to walking one. This one is called Frixio, eldest of these ones of Little Solace. Lord Commander, Alpha Squad reporting, sir. Nothing of note at Lark's call, sir. Understood. Return to Area 12. Damn it all. Where is that accursed icon hiding? No sign of our w wizened friend. I'm afraid not, my lord. Shall I order the search perimeter be expanded? Absolutely not. We risk alerting the Gridanians to our presence. His Excellency bid us avoid a necessary confrontation. Low, the, low though I am to admit it, I have found no evidence to suggest that Ramu will be gracing the mortal realm in the near future. I ask you, what good is a god who does not grant one's wishes? Were I a sylph, I should strongly consider finding myself another idol. Which reminds me, what are the sylphs we captured? A handful of them seemed to be reasonable, reasonably good health when I last I looked. <laughs> Uh, uh, apologies, my lord. I fear we may have been overzealous in our effort to compel them to summon their icon. Really, Centurion? Were you not aware that vegetables bruise easily? It is well that I did not entrust you with the important task of making my dinner. Well, mayhap it was a kindness. Better dead in truth than dead to one's own god, I suppose, if you believe in such things. Dawn is upon us. Make ready to withdraw. Withdraw. <laughs> Useless. We are so close to completion, I can fair taste it. But at this rate, no. I must be patient. Our efforts will bear fruit in due time. What was it you always said? Ah, yes. Though it mean bringing down the very heavens, who shall challenge the limits of possibility if not we? And that alone were you right, Garland. But your star is long fallen, while mine doth begin to rise. And it shall burn so bright, so bright that the Lord Van Bowser's ultimate weapon will seem a mere candle beside it. <laughs> Those walking ones did. Those walking ones did for Noxia. This one is certain of it. This one fears that other, that other. This one fears that other taken ones also suffer the same fate. This one is convinced. Walking ones have black hearts. Seek only to harm these ones. Walking ones are not to be trusted. Now, now, Noxia, do not pass judgment too hastily. Not all walking ones are alike. Though there are evil ones among the walking ones, there are good ones also. Yep. Hmm? Does walking one feel unwell? This one would know. What brings walking one to this place? I was looking for your green A came to this one's rescue at Noroxia's bidding, then this one owes Walking One a debt of gratitude. Hmm? Walking One has questions about Lord Ramu? This, then this one will provide answers. But first, let these ones quit this lightless place. 
This one will turn to little solace. When walking one is ready, please come and see this one. These ones may speak properly then. <laughs> then it's settled. Let this one accompany walking one outside. For some reason I like their music. We made it out alive. I really dislike you too. You haven't helped one bit. At least Thanker it was, you know. Putting knives and beastmen chests and stuff. Y'all ain't doing that. Ah, you're back. Tell me the Sylph Elder as well. Thank the gods for that. I don't rightly know what to make of the rest of your tale, but I'm full glad Frixio didn't come to any harm. Ah, but there I go tempting fate. Run over to Lil Solace and secure his peace with the Sylphs before aught else befalls us, eh? Rest assured, I'll send word to our friends or of Charleyan and the Twin Adder both. You've done Gridania a great service this day, lass, and earned yourself a place of honor here at the Druthers in so doing. Be sure and come by whenever you feel like a drop of quirk and firewater. 